All right, guys, KB32 here, check it out. We're sitting here in the Freedom Studios. I'm actually up in Pennsylvania. Let me tell you something. I am a North Carolina guy, but I will tell you this right now. I absolutely love Pennsylvania. Uh, and I get to come up here about two, three times a month now. Uh, can't do it as quite as much as I used to, which is why you don't see a lot of shooting videos <laughs> along with, uh, well, let's just say this ammo ain't cheap no more. Okay. So what are we doing? We are talking about the new build here. Okay. What I like to do for the most part is I like to, uh, build a series. We're going to talk about different optics. We're going to talk about triggers. We're going to talk about all kinds of cool stuff. And this one, I had the six art build and uh, on that uh, also with my my DMR rifle I used this guy right here with the JP and I've got that upper is sitting at the house but I took the arc build apart and I revamped it and then what I did was uh, got this guy right here this is the proof research barrel now what we're going to do here is I'm going to scope this thing out I want you to see the interior of her, interior of it Proof Research makes some of, the, in my opinion, most accurate barrels, most consistent barrels. Uh, one of the things that I was using on the old three-gun rifle is the uh, solid stainless steel one. At the time, that's all I could afford. Uh, thanks to the guys over there at Optics Planet, they went ahead and sent this bad boy out to the channel. Now, oh, speaking of Optics Planet, what we're planning on doing, we are still going to do the giveaway. They sent one of these guys right here. This is the Lee Precision Challenger lock thing, <laughs> breech lock system. Guys, I'll tell you this, uh, you're going to get a brand new one. This is one that I use uh, constantly, constantly. Uh, as a matter of fact, on an off story, we're going to talk about this real quickly with uh, the thing that they're doing with the ammo. Uh, I actually ordered all the parts from Dylan Precision last night, thanks to my friend Pops Quest, who helped me out to go ahead and did the uh, caliber conversion kit, the feeder tray, and then... Uh, a new uh, quick set. So we've got the charging uh, powder charge and everything. So we just do two, two, three. And I can also, because I've got a new uh, quick thing, I'm going to use it to do uh, resizing the capping. The only thing I got to do manually is the trimming, which we use the lead trimmer and uh, deburring and chamfer thing. Interesting enough, I can't wait to test that out. But guys, I use this guy every day. So we're going to do a giveaway. I've got to come up with the rules, not to mention, but uh, Optics Planet did donate that to the channel to do the giveaway. All right. So what are we doing? Uh, we took and we designed or, and not two concepts. What's a concept? Concept is if I were to design and build a, the ultimate three gun rifle, what would that consist of? Well, I gotta be honest with you, JP, Trigger Tech, Proof Research Barrel, uh, and that's about it. Ultradyne. Ultradyne also. Now, on this rifle, this specific rifle, proof research. Okay, uh, we are going to use the Apollo because I'm not going to pull the Apollo S off of my other builds uh, just because they're zeroed and ready to go. But we're going to put the regular old Apollo on here, which by far, uh, Ultradyne makes the absolute greatest, in my opinion, uh, muzzle brakes to in, uh, eliminate muzzle rise and uh, recoil. All right, so. With that, uh, we, I'm going to do an individual review. And uh, what you see here, this is the primary arms, PLX with the ACSS reticle, the M8, uh, Raptor M8. And we'll do an individual review on this guy right here. This is different from the uh, other one that I was using that had the M8 that's set up for meters. This is set up for yards. The reticle on this thing is just, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Dimitri, you outdid yourself. Um, the turrets, you have uh, changeable turrets where you can put uh, an adjustable turret up here, uh, these one-tenth mil adjustments in this guy, and uh, also you have a, an auto on and off uh, shake and wake kind of deal. So it's really cool that they have that. So that's interesting. Um, what else? That's it. So when we get done with this thing, I'm going to go ahead and take it out. Uh, I'm going to run my old 77 grain uh, rounds that I reload for. And then uh, we'll see how accurate it is with that stuff. Uh, I think their muzzle velocity is way too high for that. But also we're going to test it out with some uh, 556 that I brought up uh, from the guys over there at Callaway Ballistics. And we're also going to check it out with some of my other reloads. But with that, uh, the only thing that I had to I bought on this thing because I had the parts previous uh, was the handguard and a uh, this is the bolt that I used from the six R uh, the bolt carrier. But I had to buy the bolt for it, and I wanted it to be JP as uh, as well. 
But uh, Ben Zimmerman, uh, you guys, thanks so much over there at JP. You uh, help uh, with some of the parts and pieces. But I, after that, man, that's it. We're going to go ahead and put this thing together. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy. I'm going to put the music to the uh, interior, and we're going to check the bore out in the chamber of this guy. This is absolutely one of the most ap gorgeous barrels that I've ever seen. Man, they do a great job. Anyway, with that being said, guys, I uh, just wanted to do a middle of the week video. Uh, I thought it'd be kind of cool. We're going to do some reviews this week. We've got a bunch of red dots we're going to be doing. Uh, I've got a new company out there, Zero Tech. Zero Tech? I believe it is. And then uh, also we've got uh, several other items that we're going to be doing reviews as well. And then, uh, again, we're going to bump back to Sightmark, man, because I'm going to tell you something. M-Spec, I'm still impressed with that thing. So with that being said, guys, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't done so. Support the red, white, and blue. God bless America. God bless his men, women in uniform. 24-7 for our freedom, because freedom's not free. I'm using dual mics now, so I hope you can hear the mic up here. And I got this thing over here, and I hope it doesn't pick up a lot of my <laughs> breathing on it. But anyway, that's it, man. Look at that. Y'all be good. Boom.